ladies and welcome back to my channel I know I know it's been a extremely long time since I have uploaded a video for you guys and even this particular video is like two weeks past due and I apologize for that but my wedding is in four weeks and it's been taking up all my time anyways this video is going to be featuring this brush set that I received from Coastal Scents it's the Brush Affair Vanity Collection this is such a beautiful um, and affordable brush collection. So for all my ladies who are in my, in my guys who are starting off in the makeup world and need to build their um, brush collection, I recommend Coastal Scents br brushes like 100%. This is my third Coastal Scents brush set that I own. And not to mention, I just ordered like a whole bunch of their individual brushes that I cannot wait to try out and use for you guys. I just did a haul that I will feature for you guys. But like I said, this video is pretty much just showcasing this brush set. I'm just going to demonstrate to you guys, you know, how well they perform, I guess. So there's no rhyme or reason to this particular makeup look that I've did I just wanted to put together something um, just showing um, the versatility of this um, makeup brush set so I decided to include both face and eyes in this video so I'll show you um, some of the face brushes that are in here as well as some of the um, eye brushes that are in here and as the video goes along I'll let you know what brushes that I'm using but other than that I'm not really going to explain myself in this video as far as makeup is concerned on what I'm doing I'm just gonna let you guys follow the video because the video is not per se about the makeup look but I thought I would you know instead of just doing a brush review I thought I would give you also um, I, I, I thought I would let you guys see the brushes in brushes boy I cannot talk that's what I get for not filming in a long time um, I just wanted, I didn't just want to do a review video, I wanted to show you guys the brushes themselves in action. So yeah, I'll pop in whenever the brushes come up, but other than that, just follow the video and enjoy the music. Now this kit did come with a foundation brush. Of the traditional one but I totally forgot about it and I didn't use it at the beginning but I remember it afterwards and I did use it afterwards the brush that I'm using right now is the flat buffer brush and yeah it is good for wet and dry um, products all the brushes are actually it's synthetic brushes and I'm just going to read to you what it says on the back of the box. The Brush Affair Vanity Collection is a complete collection of luxury makeup brushes used by the pros. Each colorful brush caters to a different need no matter what look you're trying to achieve. This set features 22 beautiful brushes, each with a matte black ferrule and synthetic bristles. Excellent for applying both dry and liquid products. All 22 brushes fit perfectly together in a matte black leathering case that can fold up and be secured with mag <clears throat> with magnets making this the ideal set for travel which I do agree I am so obsessed with the carrying case that came with this it is soft it is very classy it's very nice and sturdy and it looks like a lot of time and effort was put into that so I truly truly love this particular set um, out of the two sets that are, are out of the two sets that I already own, this one, I, I might have to say it's getting close up there to being my favorite. The bristles on this brush are so, am I saying that right? The bristles? Do I want to say the bristles? Yes, I want to say the bristles. The bristles on these brushes are by far the softest bristles ever. And I want to say they're probably almost too soft because I wasn't sure if I was applying enough pressure at times. So it was kind of confusing. But other than that... I mean, the, they apply makeup well and evenly, and they're extremely soft. The brush that I just used was the Medium Blender brush. And quickly, I want to talk about this here palette that I'm showing you guys. This is the Coastal Sense 26 blush. 20 cents. 20 cents. 26 eyeshadow and blush palette. I absolutely am in love with this palette. This 
palette I did purchase with my own moolah. They did not send this to me. I purchased it with my own moolah. I'm obsessed with this palette. This palette is amazing. And I think it's going to be my new go-to eyeshadow palette for a while because it has all the colors I like in it. And the blushes in this palette are amazeballs. This palette, guys, I truly 100% recommend this palette. I will leave the link and the pricing for the palette and the brushes down in the description box for you guys. But I recommend the Coastal Sense 26 Shadow and Blush Palette. If you don't already have this palette, go get it. And this video is not even about the palette, but I'm just saying. This palette is amazing. And right now, the brush that I'm using is the Large Shadow. No, that's not the Large Shadow Brush. Yes, it is. It's the Large Shadow Brush. Now, I'm going into a very oldie but goodie. This is the Sleek eyeshadow palette in the color sunset and I just use one of those colors out of that um, I'm talking about that palette because I'm thinking that I want to do um, I want to dive down in my stash of makeup and start using some old palettes and some old makeup that I haven't used in a while that you know I started off with but haven't used it and I've forgotten so um, yeah I'm thinking about doing that if you guys want to see some looks using some throwback palettes just let me know now everything that I did on the top of the eye I am now doing on the bottom of the um, lower lash line as well so I'm repeating those steps and I was still using the large the medium blender brush now I'm going in with the The particular brush I'm using right now, I don't think came out of this palette. Now, the br brush that I'm using right here, this one is, and I'm reading the box because, you know, I don't know them by heart. The Blending Shadow Brush. And then the one I'm using for my inner tear duct is the oh is that oh, I don't know what brush that is and I don't think it comes from this set so I'm not going to try to tell you guys what it is because I don't think it comes from this set if it's not purple then it didn't come from the set <laughs> I'll just tell you guys quickly it comes with the flat buffer brush uh, angle br blush brush a powder brush a dual fiber brush a tapered powder brush a foundation brush a large blender br um, brush a pointed precision brush a medium shadow brush a large shadow brush a medium blender doe foot blender tapered blender small blender concealer pointed blending blending shadow dome shadow medium line brow and small liner um brow as well as a lip and angled liner brush this is like the perfect beginner set right here for sure now i did not use the angled liner brush out of this kit because to be quite honest i'm not a fan of angled liner brushes so yeah i didn't use that one I stuck to the the liner brush that I use in this video is from the Coastal Scents Pearl Collection. I like those. I like the straight straight ones. Now to apply my uh, mineral concealer under my eyes, I am using. the large shadow brush that has become a very versatile brush I use it for everything and now I'm blending it out I blended it out in case you guys are curious with an elf um, concealer brush but that's not what this video is about. It's about closes, right? It's about closes. Now, to apply my contour that was turned out to be way too dark, I'm using the uh, pointed precision brush. But though I could be lying, I believe it's the large. No, I'm using the large blender brush 
to apply the con the contour um, yeah now I'm gonna go in with the powder brush and I'm just gonna use that to you know set my foundation and kind of soften up that contour because I wasn't expecting that palette to be so pigmented and that color to be so dark but again I'm using the powder brush from the um, brush of fair vanity collection going back in with the large blender brush I'm just taking um, my covergirl bronzer and further blending out my contour Now to apply my blush from the Coastal Sis 26 Shadow and Blush Palette, I'm taking the um, Tapered Powder Brush from the Vanity Affair collection. And to apply my highlight, I am going in with the same large shadow brush. That, uh, like I said, I use it for everything. This kit does come with a lip brush, but I did not use it in this video because, to be quite truthfully, I never use lip brushes. Um, so yeah, that is really it. Um, my thoughts on this set, it is a must-have in your collection. If you collect makeup brush sets, if you are starting off um, as a makeup artist, or even if you're already a stylish makeup artist and you just need to broaden your brush collection, I really highly recommend the Coastal Sense blush. Did I say Coastal Sense blushes? The Coastal Sense brushes all together. I think all their brushes are great. Um, and like I said before, this is my third brush set from them. And I just absolutely love their brushes. So yeah. I will leave all the information you guys need for um, where to find these brushes, how much they cost down in the description box as well as the Coastal Sense 26 eyeshadow and blush palette. And that concludes my little review slash um, tutorial for you guys. If you have any questions, please feel free to leave them down in the comment section and I'll catch you guys in another video. Bye guys.